Hi everyone, this is JD, your gadget review friend. It's been a few years now and Huawei still can get Google services and apps working on their Huawei phones. Especially Gmail, we have few workarounds how to make it work, but the sync won't be as smooth as a native installation and it may pose threat when you rely on workarounds instead of normal process. So Huawei came up with a solution to replace Gmail, which is one of the top reasons why people want a phone with Google services. This is the new Huawei's Petal Mail app, the Gmail replacement. We will discuss how to access it, the new features, how to use it, and some missing features. Hey, don't forget to subscribe, my friend. Let's go! A little bit of history and background, Huawei now have their own email service called Petal Mail. Available through Huawei App Gallery, Petal Mail offers a complete email experience with a dedicated app. Recently, Huawei started testing several new features of this app, which have been made available to public beta testers in China. These beta testers had access to the new user experience, multi-account management, and all-around improvements. So how to access it? Starting with the mobile app, search and download for Petal Mail via App Gallery. Currently, this email app can be installed on devices running on EMUI 4.0 or later. And for website, sign in or log into your account on the official Petal Mail website from a PC browser to use the mailbox service. This cannot be accessed using a regular mobile browser and it also has a browser compatibility. Chrome 25 or later, Firefox 23 or later, Opera 15 or later, or Microsoft Edge. This is how the website will look like. Pretty simple and straightforward, there's a login window. Once you log in, you will go to the minimalist web email client. Let's go back to the phone. If this is your first time, you can register your own email address. It will be at petalmail.com. This app will have access to your account information, device information, network information, and service usage information, as well as permission on your internet and storage. Pretty safe, nothing out of ordinary. So you will have the inbox, stored, draft, sent. You will also have the archive, trash, and spam. Super minimalist, nothing complicated. These are the list of the new features of the Petal Mail app. For the missing features, I guess the only thing I want to see is the autocomplete sentence on Gmail. Saves you a lot of time typing and typo errors. The new users of the Huawei Petal Mail service will have access to at petalmail.com address. The Huawei App Gallery has the main client app available for download. This is how the new users can get started on the Huawei Petal Mail. So for Huawei owners without the Gmail app or using G Space or Dual Space to install Gmail, is it time to fully embrace Huawei ecosystem and install Petal Mail? Leave your comment below and as always, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.